Hey guys, Kieran here. I am back with a brand new Let's Play. That's right, we're going to play Half-Life 2, Episode 2. The third installment of the Half-Life 2 series. Chapter 1, To the White Forest. Loading. Okay. Half-Life 2, Episode 2. Oh, uh... Just feeling dodgy already. What? Oh my god. Where are we? We weren't in the train. Oh. Okay. Ah! Oh, oh jeez. Sploosh. Okay. I got on it like, oh. 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 Um. Gordon? Yeah? Oh, Gordon, thank God you're okay. Hold on a sec. I'll get you out of there. Hey, look. The gravity Let's gun. This still works. The zero point Stand field back. energy manipulator. Yeah. Oh! You wow. saved me. I forgot what a kick this thing has. Here, you take the gravity gun. You're better with it than I am. Oh, oh sorry. When I couldn't find you, I got... <laughs> I know, I know. I shouldn't have worried. Well, we should keep moving. Yeah. I'm sure the Combine haven't forgotten about us. I heard Vortigons a few minutes ago. Maybe they're still around. We've got a long way to go to find my dad. It'd be nice to have some extra help. Okay. I don't remember the train looking like that, but... I could be wrong. Ah, this looks like the right way. Hello? Oh my gosh. To the White Forest. Oh man. Oh my god. The Citadel. What the hell is happening? Uh oh. Oh! Ooh. Wow. What an amazing set piece. Hi. Oh, are you okay? Yeah. It's like the first days all over again. I hope we don't get many more. We will. Look at this flat rock. Right. So the train's collapsed. We didn't notice the mine, we walked straight past. Take that! Ah, the good old bottle of... Uh... Yeah, let's just go face first into the mine, it'll be fine. The not at all spooky mine of... Something. Ah, F6 is to save. I wouldn't be surprised if the rebels use this place. I don't know. Oh, jeez. Do you hear something? Scattering. Oh. Oh, he gads. Ah! Oh, um. Control to crouch, hang on. Okay, that's better. Well, safe haven it ain't. Uh -huh. Oh gosh. Zombies. Don't say that. 
Whoa. Gas bottle. Have a bottle aside of you. Okay. What's on here? Oh. Yabba my icing. Okay. Is there nothing down here? No, oh, there's nothing down here. Okay. I'm on it. Oh. The zombie. Wow. That cleared the area. Okay. Do be. I don't mind if I do. Right. Hey, look. Let's see if we can a message to my dad. Dr. Kleiner and my dad are up north at an old missile base. I hope they're still using this frequency. They're trying to help launch a... Ah, here we go. Damn. What now? Hmm. If I were to... Hmm. Let me see if I can get it working again. Okay. Okay. What a mess. This could take a while. Hey, if you have any blinding insights into how to fix this, go for it. What about this plug? Not sure what I did, but it worked. Now, to check in. Right, now to check in. This fella's coming with me. White Forest. White Forest, this is Alex Vance. Do you read? White Forest, come in. White Forest, are you there? Alex! My goodness! Is that really you? Yes, and Gordon too. We're okay. We made it out of City 17. <sighs> Alex, thank God. I can hardly believe it. Don't worry, Dad. We're fine. But something really strange is happening with the Citadel. Oh yes, we've been monitoring the situation. The raw discharge of the meltdown has been focused into a coherent beam of portal energy. It's the Combine. They're trying to open another gateway. Yes, what you're seeing is the infancy of a super portal. If it attains full strength... It'll be the seven hour war all over again. Oh no. Except this time we won't last seven minutes. What if that's why they were sending so much data from the Citadel? So that data? Data? Citadel? In the control room, they were feeding huge volumes of data directly into the core destruction sequence. Magnuson, did you hear that? I'll bet it's the Combine Portal Code. Yes, yes, I'm not deaf. I downloaded the whole packet. They've been chasing us ever since. Well, of course they have. You see, Kleiner, it's the linchpin of all of their plans. Well, I can see that. I never Somewhere said. Somewhere in that sequence, they would have had to establish a connection with the far side. What you have there, young lady, is the specific contact code for the Combine Overworld. Good Ooh. God. Now, if I am right about this, and I have no reason to doubt myself, you are carrying the very code Dr. Mossman had hoped to recover. Now, how soon can you get here? Well, we'll have to get our bearings, but we can definitely... There is no time to waste. We'll need to step up the launch schedule. And now, as soon as you get here with the signature data, we'll encode the satellite and get the damn thing into orbit. Get here as quickly as you can, you two. For God's Dad. sake. Dad, Dad. you're breaking up. Come in. Biotics Dad, are you confirmed. there? Dad. Continue oh. surface sector sweep. Remote compliance. They're still trapped. Exterminate. Seek passive signature imprint. Mandate sublevel restrictions. Come on, this way. Ooh. Yeah, so I'm going to attempt this playthrough to uh, waste time with the old Noam Chomsky. Because I've never done that before. So it might, it might add a funny thing to this let's play. Yeah, Noam Chomsky came into use. Okay, hang on. I could leave him there for a bit. Yeah, I am.
Geronimo! Okay. Nice. That did the trick. Yeah, it did. I can always count on you to find a way through. Yeah. Yes, you can, Noam Chomsky. Doctor Magnuson has an old rocket up at White Forest. He's been hoping for the day when he could launch a satellite to tap into the old array they set up at Black Mesa. But getting a launch off while the combine was intact, there was just no way. I'm not sure how they'll use a satellite to shut down that portal, but I guess we'll find out when we get there. Okay. Yeah, not too creepy. Do you hear a uh, smash sound? Noam Chomsky, go check it out. Oops. Uh, that was a bit far. <laughs> One second. <laughs> okay. Let's try that again. Didn't mean to chuck him that far. I'm not sure you can get back there. Ah, here we go. Um, you check it out first, Mr. Chomsky. Oh. What was that? What was that? Did you hear that? Okay, I think that's okay. I think that's an okay place to put Noam Chomsky. Oh, well, let's um, have a look. There's a few dead antlions. Auntie lions. It's not at all creepy, is it? Quiet. We're not alone. Okay. Hey, can you figure out a way to get this gate open? Um Let's see here. Um Gate, 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 gate. This is where I'm lost. Can't go in there. I remember something happening in there. Um, I'm being stupid, aren't I? Oh, oh yeah, the hole in the ceiling, of course. Look at me! I'm being a circus. Keep watch out here. I heard whoop whoop again. Bonk. Careful. All right, here, here it goes. What? Oh. Not too creepy. Gordon, there's something snooping around out here. Oh. oh my god. Oh no. Ow. Well, that's the end of her. Yep, can confirm. No. Oh. Chara. Hmm. What's he doing? He's encasing her in a cocoon. What? 
Alex Vance. Yeah. The time has come. She got stabbed by a thing. Ah, the free man. Hi. I'm pleased to see at least you are unharmed. You call this unharmed? <laughs> Her condition is grave. Can you check up on Noam Chomsky as well? Ow! Healing her will require more than I alone can conjure. Let me summon my kin. Awiga! Awuga! Oh yeah. Ooh. My that. kin will meet us at a sheltered location beneath the surface. We must move her there quickly. I will stabilize her if the free man will provide us with protection. Okay. Let thought... us hurry, free man. Help awaits us in the mines. Come on, Noam. Naomi, you're coming with me. There'll be a lot of bits. Her state is delicate. All right, mate. Okay, where are we going? Hurry up, boy. Oh, hang on. Oh, oh I did not. The feeling can restore this elevator's functionality. Where's the elevator functionality? Oh, I see. Do you see what I see? Oh, do I seriously have to? Okay. Old. Okay, right, fine. Oh. G, please. I remember this bit. But I've never done it with Noam Chomsky on my hand, on hand, so. Um, apologies if I keep picking him up and dropping him. I did look at the basic places where you need to leave him. We can leave him... In a minute. Ah, look. Okay. Can't get all that stuff. Oh. Hello? Okay, you're gonna have to be my emotional support gnome. <laughs> Come on, seriously. I'm hearing things. Oh, oh no. This is ridiculous. I want that star. Okay. We'll get it in a minute. What can I even be bothered? Oh, this is brilliant, isn't it? Great. I'm all wasting time. <laughs> In the spooky and flying field maze. Well, mine. Okay, the gnome's up there. I mean, I think. I don't know. Okay. Where is he? Where's he gone? I don't know. I'm having trouble with this lift. That's what I'm having trouble with. Right, let's try and get our, grab this shizzle if we can. Nope. Oh, never mind. Right. Let's move this. Hang on. Wait, where's the... Where's the flipping gnome? Ow! Is he back down here? 
Where is he? Where are you, me old chum? Oh. Wait. Right. Okay. There we go. I have to cut all that out. Okay, we finally got a shooter, mate. Okay, um, I'll send you down first. Can you do a do a report if it's safe? You didn't report on whether it was safe. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Right, here we go. Um, one second. Let's just drop him down. Oh no, the blooming grubs. Oh! Okay. Okay, come on. Oh. Um, Chomsky, can you... Let's probably preserve our ammo, but... That's not how we do things here at the Kiranator. We make s stupid decisions like bringing a gnome along with us. Although, you go for kill the grubs, it does give us health. Um, was there anything down here? No. Where's the gnome? Well, we can kill a few of them. Wait, where's the gnome? One second. I did chuck him down there, right? Ah! Found it! Oh, yeah, very funny. Okay. Oh. Noam Chomsky. Hello. Well, this might be a good place to call today's episode. So, um... I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, all that usual YouTube shares is appreciated. Thanks for watching and toodle pipski.